there may not be a better duo in the NHL right now than Nikita Kucherov and Steven Stamkos. It's just this instant thing where two guys are on the same page. They can read each other on the ice. These two guys have a string between them. The plays they make, simply outstanding. It allows you to go out and just react. Steve goes ahead to Kucherov. He's in on quick alone. He fakes, he scores! It almost simplifies the game when you know where a teammate is going to be. And Kuch is a guy who makes it easier for me <laughs> on the ice because I know what he's thinking. Do some one piece, Kuchy. They work so much on it, that's something that really rubs on on the rest of the team. You can see them after practice working on stuff. Did you see uh, Spezza's goal last night? Yeah. Radulov? That was a nice pass. Sick pass. I think it's a little bit like the Sedins, you know, they know where each other are. Their hockey minds are, are they're so smart on the ice and instant chemistry. One of the things as a coach is, you know, sometimes you get challenged for over tinkering. Well, <laughs> this is one thing you really didn't have to tinker with. Hey, Coach! Get on TV. When you're having success and fun, like we, it's fun to go out on the ice every day. Well, I just agree. <laughs> I'm just here, uh, you know, playing with time, and, uh, enjoying my time. And he just life. plays on my line because the coach puts him there. He doesn't want to. The little Salouy back in front again. Stamkos scores. Number 60 for Steven Stamkos. Marty was definitely a pass-first guy. He was always telling me to get him a puck and get open, and I'll, I'll find a way to get it to you. Where Cooch, he's got such a, an amazing release and a little more of a pure shooter than, than Marty was. I watched Marty recently, how you play with him and what he does in ice, and I think, you know, sometimes I remember it and, you know, trying to fit my game into his game, and, you know, I know where Sam is going to be, and uh, I know when I watched them, I saw them talking, you know, and Mario would, you know, say, you know, buy time or, you know, give me a little space or something like, you know, a little face. And I just picked it up and, uh, you know, just fit into my game. And uh, I think that's been helpful so far. Because if those two guys come out, yeah. and they put their, obviously, the first one I'll pass to Sergey because he can bomb it. Right. But then the second time, if we do it, they're going to cheat that way. Yeah. And, you know, I always said it when I played with Marty, you know, I was keeping him young. I know we're not that different in age, but, you know, I see Cooch working on his game, and, it, and, you know, it motivates me to keep working on my game and try to keep up with him out there. So it's been, uh, it's been, it's been great that way. <laughs> the, the old 28-year-old. 